This week, many miles from this shore, the latest evidence should be published about what global warming, rising sea levels and changing weather will mean for communities' life ease. But here in Bangladesh, somebody of that global climate change could already be having a profound effect. Delor Hussain is a farmer with a big problem. He has no farmland left where he used to grow his cattle, fishermen malcast their next. Increasing river erosion has once again forced him to abandon his home. The tide is much higher nowadays. Fifteen-year-old Rima Akta lost everything she had to river erosion. She has now been taken in by a charity which gives her home and education. If Bangladesh is to face more floods, the human and social cost could be huge. Dr. Atik Rahman is one of the leaders of the latest IPCC report looking at the impact of climate change. Reduce the greenhouse gas now. It's not tomorrow. It's not beyond the Kyoto regime. It's now. Because otherwise it will be totally out of control. And the communities, particularly the coastal Bangladeshi communities and many other small islanders will have to pay with their lives. Delor Hussain says he has not heard of global warming, but this week we'll hear the latest evidence for how much it may already be affecting people like him. The report is likely to show that this watery land is one of the most vulnerable places on the planet. Mithun Mustafiz, Bushaki News, Dhaka.